what is the difference between vamp and zamp vamp and zamp vamp actually stands for windows apache mysql and php while the zamp it stands for xos again apache mysql and uh, P php similar to vamp and then this one more p is for perl and what do we mean by xos it means it can be used for any operating system this is very important xamp can be used for any operating system so xamp is easy to use than vamp the best advantage of, of using this vamp is that the configuration is very easy it is very easy to set up vamp in on your system but xamp the c panel of your xamp there is a panel if you see is very nice and good for beginner Zamp has C, they have buttons like start, pause, and stop button. They work very nicely by functionality. And you can add other services to Zamp also. And Zamp is more powerful and resource consuming than VAMP. So VAMP provides support for MySQL and PHP. As the name suggests, this M is for MySQL, P is for PHP. And Zamp provides support for MySQL, PHP, also for Perl, P -E -R -L, Perl. So Zamp also has this uh, SSL feature, uh, while this Vamp does not. So this is secure socket layer. So Vamp provides support for MySQL and PHP. Zamp provides, as we just said, that for MySQL, PHP, and Perl. So if your applications need to deal with native web apps only. Yes, you can go for VAM. But if you need advanced features, as you just saw, you have to go to or go for XAM. So as of priority, you can or you can't run both together with default installation. As XAM is always having a higher priority and it takes up ports like the ports for your MySQL. These there are a number of ports which are to be used. So VAMP cannot be run in parallel with XAM. So you can only install one or you should only install one. So this was a basic idea about, about XAM pen VAMP. So it is up to you which web server. Thank you, you so much.